people in the world, why would Hecate pick me? Hello witches, I'm answering questions I've gotten on videos about Hecate. If you have a question, see if I've answered it in a video on the playlist. If not, leave it in the comments. Hecate is the goddess of many things, but right now she's coming through strongly as the goddess of the marginalized. She and her horde of restless dead exist on the fringes of society. She's always welcomed those who have no place in mainstream culture. Men who were hanged for stealing bread. Women who perished from attempting to perform self-abortions. Babies who died before they were baptized, at least in the later myths when Christianity was colonizing the world. People who experienced gut-wrenching trauma have long come to her to heal them, and she surrounds herself with those whom no one else wants. When I first heard her call, she seemed so dark and strong and edgy that I didn't know why she wanted me. I was anxious and depressed, sick with cancer, and trapped in a domestic abuse situation. Earlier this year, at 41 years old, I discovered I'm autistic, which explains the bullying and the sense of never belonging I've endured my whole life. I thought, why would she want an autistic, wounded woman child? I can't possibly be hearing from her. It's just a coincidence because everyone else around me is talking about her. They're so put together and I'm so not. Then it finally hit me and this was long after I started working with her. It's not in spite of those things that she wants me. It's because of those things. It's because I'm wounded and struggling. Because I'm autistic and fucking weird. I'm on the fringes of society like her and her horde of restless dead, and maybe I hadn't found my tribe yet because I hadn't found her yet. In the new age and witchy communities, I hear this word a lot. Resonate. That really resonates with me. I like this crystal. Its powers really resonate with me. I like that person's story. It really resonates with what I've been through. Let me read you definition number 4a of the noun resonant from dictionary.com. Physics. The state of a system in which an abnormally large vibration is produced in response to an external stimulus occurring when the frequency of the stimulus is the same or nearly the same as the natural vibration frequency of the system. Have I ever told you that I have a Bachelor of Science in Physics? That's a story for another day. Let me explain this though. In music, when you have a stringed instrument like a violin and you play a note on another instrument, the string on the violin at that same pitch will vibrate in resonance with that instrument. The string hasn't been touched with anything solid, but it resonates with the other instrument. What I have said before is that you're drawn to Hecate because you are resonant with her. When she sounds her note near you, the strings that make up your soul vibrate at the same note. If they didn't, you'd be indifferent to her, but you're not. You feel inside yourself the song of Hecate. While I do frequently talk about her calling you, it's a metaphor for what I just described. The reason you're drawn toward her is because the same substance that she's made of exists in you. She's not picking you or calling you. You're realizing who you are, that she is who you are, and that you are who she is. Listen to it. Listen to your soul.